Hello and welcome to the roundup of this week's edition of the Engineering News and Mining Weekly magazine, published on Friday 29 October 2021. In this week's cover article, Engineering News and Mining Weekly Senior Deputy Editor Irma Fenter highlights how the electric vehicle revolution will be felt in South Africa in the coming years. South African new vehicle buyers will have a choice of about 20 battery electric vehicles by 2023, a significant jump from the current four models available in local showrooms. This goes to show that it's not a question of if, but rather when South Africans will drive and own their first electric vehicle. The engineering news features focus on business in Africa, where transport infrastructure is key to African economic growth. Warehousing and storage, where demand for logistic storage space remains high. And roads, where the CSIR is researching the use of waste material in road construction. The Mining Weekly features focus on project management, where a sustainable rare earth separation facility is on the horizon. And mine mechanization, modernization and automation, where a diamond producer reaps the rewards of modernization. This week's business leader is Tracy Henry, CEO of Chikilulu Social Investments. And as this week's cartoon shows, if COP26 can create the political will needed for collective action on climate change, there's still a way to flatten the climate curve. We hope you enjoy this week's edition of Crema Media's Engineering News and Mining Weekly, the magazine that offers you news about developments in the real economy. Happy reading and see you next time.